And, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, friends of all ages, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to T-Mobile Gaming. My name is Troy, and we are diving back into the land of Westeros and the Seven Kingdoms. So join me as we go beyond the wall. Are we going to continue on with the story? I am stuck currently on a boss battle. I'll tell you that right now. I've been kind of working through other levels, trying to work up my guys. Um, I've tried to play this level a couple times. I've been trying to get this video out for a couple days, but... I just keep having technical difficulties and I haven't been able to save the video. I've been recording my voice, but the video won't save to my phone. So that's why all these levels are done, because <laughs> I've been working through them. Regardless, we will continue to press on and pray to the old gods and the new that we can get this video chapter three out cool all right so that being said you know what time it is it's time for a boss battle let's go now i've been running this battle on auto for the last couple of times and it hasn't been working for me so what we're gonna do today is we're gonna go we're gonna go manual on it so we're gonna shut the auto off and start this battle let's go okay let's see so it's logical that the my most powerful guy my leader would go after their most powerful guy Now it would also make sense that we would want to team up on their most powerful guy. Would that make would that not make sense? So let's move that guy over there. This guy over here you can only attack this guy. And that guy there. No, I don't want to move that guy there. Let's move him there. Okay. Alright, now we got the enemy phase. Let's see what they do. Uh, guys, I don't have a good feeling about this. I do not. I do not have a good feeling about this. Okay. And one, two, and three. A hit. A very powerful hit. Let me know if you know what movie that's from. Oh, I thought he was going to hit all the... Oh, crap. I thought he was going to hit all the guys. guy down one guy down this guy, he's not he mm, my northman is really not doing anything <laughs> oh this is not good oh i feel bad i i don't i feel death is coming I feel death is coming to all my people. Yep, there's two down. Two down. Mm-hmm. Will you please... Do something. <laughs> Thank you. Turn, uh, 
I, I want to turn the auto on, but I don't. So I turn the auto on, it'll... The battle will go quicker, and it's now four on one. Never mind, forget it. This is, uh... to take the dude down with him. Managed to take a couple down. I can just beat the boss. Well, I beat the boss. Oh! Oh! I beat the boss, so I won! Oh, snap! I'll take it. I will take it, my friends. Okay, so we learned something new. If you beat the boss, you can just win the victory. You don't have to worry about the other guys. Uh, I wish I would have known that earlier. Oh, we have an animatic. Animatic. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> well, I think we found his lair. It's been so long since I've done this, I forgot what the voices sound like. This poor bastard was more organized than the Night's Watch. It's like we thought. He was storing supplies for some kind of raid below the wall. This Wolfswood, or the Wolfswood, that's the target drawn on this map. So it is. Why would a warg bother raiding a forest 400 miles below the wall? I think he meant to resettle there. Some kind of twisted revival of those old war king tales you were telling. You may be right. And that would explain the supplies. That's too far for raiding. Either way, that plan ended today, as did our trail of Red Ravens. And so much for that legend of the Red Ravens' return and all that nonsense. Hmm. Aye, it did. We'll report the news tomorrow, with the hour and the winds out there. We'll make camp here tonight. Good plan, Alvar. Good plan. That's why he's first commander. Or first... Raider. First... Whatever. First Raider? Isn't that what they're called? Kind of like second in command? Oh, they're sleeping. This is dream. My boy's dreaming. Or is he dreaming? Oh, he's dreaming. Alvar's dreaming. Oh, I think Alvar. Alvar's got the green sight. Alvar's got the green sight. Interesting. Chapter completed. Thank you. God. <laughs> oh my gosh. And now, chapter four. But we're going to leave it there, my friends. <laughs> That's right. We're going to leave it there. I beat the boss. My stress level went up. So I'm crashing now. So we're going to end it there. But make sure to come back tomorrow. So we can continue on our quest through the Seven Kingdoms, beyond the wall, in Westeros. Thank you for joining me again. This has been T-Mobile Gaming. Like, share, subscribe, all that stuff. If you want to check out the World War G podcast that I do with my buddy AJ, you can go to 
worldwarg.podbean.com or here on YouTube, or if you want to head to our Patreon and sign up for just a dollar a month, head to patreon.com slash worldwarg. All right, my friends. That's going to do it for today. See you tomorrow. Peace out.